Good morning. Uh, my name is uh, Luigi Colombo, and uh, I chaired this uh, very interesting uh, session this morning where three presentations were made by uh, Professor Novozolov, Professor Taniguchi, and uh, Enturizi from uh, 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 across uh, uh, the world. And I guess the probably perhaps the the uh, on a general scale the, the most important part is that uh, hexagonal boron nitride is a a very important material for the success of uh, graphene uh, devices. And as was uh, highlighted by Professor Novozola from Manchester, and then uh, Professor Taniguchi from Japan highlighted the importance of uh, growing these uh, high quality crystals. However, uh, where there's still a lot of uh, work to be done in order to uh, scale the single crystal growth to uh, industry relevant uh, thin films on a large scale. Uh, Professor Turisi uh, came, then came back and said, "Okay, uh, we can do, uh, we can um, uh, grow or uh, create many devices using inks rather than uh, standard uh, silicon, for example, uh, thin film processes. And so, by using inks, you can maybe overcome a lot of the issues uh, that uh, you have with uh, the uh, single crystal growth or thin film growth processes that one would need for a more traditional uh, uh, silicon uh, processing uh, uh, avenue. And so here we have on, on one hand we have uh, thin films, on the other hand we have inks, and I think they both have a role. Uh, one is maybe shorter term than the other one. And so there's still a lot of work to be done, but it's very exciting, and but it shows the importance of uh, our ability to uh, make new materials, uh, create uh, new processes uh, to achieve the, the, the goals.